So there are about 100 million households in the US. And it turns out 44% of the people bought programmable thermostat. But when people did some studies on this, only 11% of those people had those programmable thermostat programmed. Why did they buy it? Why, why, why didn't they use it? Well, it turns out the interface was a little bit complicated. There were only like two ups and but down buttons, and then you're supposed to go through it, and then Monday through Friday, and then it wasn't sure when it's going to come up, and eventually, your life sort of didn't fit the schedule that you, you know, maybe your, your husband or your you know, dad have already programmed in, and it just doesn't fit. So you put it in a hold mode, another manual mode, and overwritten the program, and then just stopped using it. We have a whole bunch of features that allow you to save energy. You just have to want to save energy, as you all do. You want to recycle, and sometimes you don't. That's OK. Again, we're, we will know where to hold, hold your hand and then do the right thing holistically. So how do some of those features work? We have this thing called auto schedule. Only thing you have to do is to turn up to the temperature you want whenever you feel like it, and turn it down to the temperature you feel like it. If it's a heating season, turn it down when you're leaving home. It's a cooling season. Turn it down for your comfort, and then turn it up whenever you're going out of the house. We learn your pattern through sensors that we have, some occupancy sensor, as well as all the temperature sensors to see what you really like. Come up with a schedule for you. Taking care of it. No more programming. 